And welcome back, this is Bella Scoopo with more Let's Play Final Fantasy V. I'm joined as always by my floating squad of Bart's Reina, Krill, and Ferris. When we last left off, we weren't floating, but we are floating now. Uh, I have changed Reina to a bard yet again because we're going to do a very difficult side quest today. One that yields... I would like to say a lot of good things, but really not so much. Not so much. Uh, for this, we need to leave more village. I figured I would just show you the journey over there uh, from where we were. Did not forget about this place. I mentioned it before, and I casually just went, huh, uh, because I was purposely ignoring this place, and I hope you also did the same. Uh, this place is not necessarily difficult, to a certain point, and then it's ridiculously difficult. We need to head around this continent, and here is the cave that I am speaking of. There are both sides of it. It doesn't really matter which side you go into. I like going in uh, to this side. I do try to save this one uh, until this point. You can go in there earlier, but you uh, may struggle. Uh, now, like I said, this cave is not that difficult up to a certain point. Uh, there is a secret passage down here, which will lead us to that point. So let's go this way. I believe we have faced everything here already. Having float in this dungeon is very, very nice. It helps you float, which is makes you immune to earthquake, which ground peeds do cast here. Now, I have changed my party quite a bit. Uh, this is for a fight that is coming up. A uh, very, very difficult fight. This, honestly, I've been trying this for, for too long. This is going to be my last attempt at it. Uh, so if I die here, that, that's pretty much it. I have uh, Bart as a uh, sorcerer. Uh, he has two-handed. Um, Reina is a time mage. Uh, I give her. Yeah, it's not gonna. That doesn't help any. Uh, let's go for caution, uh, just in case. Um, yeah, that does not matter. Uh, we also need. Um, well, Krill is the same. Krill is the same uh, with the white magic. She has the ability to summon. She's still got the healing staff. Ferris is... Uh, well, Ferris needs the ice rod. Outside of that, uh, that, that's pretty much my setup. And, and hopefully that works out for the best. And I guarantee nothing. Uh, like I said, I've been trying this for far too long. This is a very tough enemy that is purely optional. That, to be honest, I don't think you're supposed to take on at this point in the game. I'm sure you could if you level grinded or if you got lucky, but I refuse to do either. I refuse to level grind and I've not been lucky. So let's head up here. You can see Bart's hair there. That's the marker for when you start earning money. You earn 10 gil for stepping there. Step there and you earn double it for that same, for one step you get 20 gil. And it just continues to double. However, as I've said, there's a very, very difficult enemy here. Uh, one that makes me think, once again, that this is not supposed to be a fight that you're supposed to take on this early in the game. Um, it, it feels like this is a game of chicken that you're supposed to play chicken for. Um, it's just so much money, but... The enemy, the enemy is so difficult. We are up against Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh is an absolute bastard. As you saw there, he damn near killed Krill in one shot. And Krill's in the back row. You want to know what happens if he hits Bart? You die. Okay, we're going to go for haste two. Uh, we need Gollum up immediately. Now, the way that Gollum works is not based on attacks, as far as I can tell, how many attacks that he takes. Uh, it's based on how much damage he receives before he just, like, fuck it, I'm not doing that anymore. Uh, so we're going to pretty much cast him as often as I can. Um, we're going to go for ice three. This guy is, is weak to ice. He absorbs everything else. Uh, the ice rod does up how much damage... Uh, Ice 3 does. Oh, God. Uh, his main attack is going to be Turtle. Oh, nice. We got a hit there. Uh, if you get hit with Turtle... You fucking can meet... Like I said, I am not lucky with this fight at all. Let's go for Slow 2. See if we can get that on him. Um, if we can, this will make that immensely easier. We did! It does not always hit. To be honest, Slow 2 does not always hit. Alright, so we have slowed him down. We are immune to physical attacks. We need, uh... We need to continue doing nice three, to be honest with you. Um, 
This guy can be an absolute dick and absolutely destroy your party very, very quickly. He has a ton of HP, I believe, uh, equaling the most in this game. Uh, you won't find anybody with more HP than this guy, as far as I remember. That, I could be wrong on that, though. All right, wait for yeah, wait for the phoenix down, then go for the golem. And now Bart is blinded, which doesn't help any. And I think I mistimed that golem, unfortunately. All right, let's continue casting ice. Ice uh, definitely does help. Oh, God. Slow doesn't seem to help that much, to be honest with you. But slow too, hopefully, does help. Uh, this is this is a tough ass fight. Very 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 difficult. All right, um, haste. Get Bart's up to speed with everybody else. Let's go for another golem. Uh, when he hits you with turtle, turtle causes not only does it let him attack twice, it also inflicts a ton of status ailments on you, uh, including most importantly probably uh, old and poison. Old and poison will probably weaken will uh, weaken my attacks and kill me over time. And that is not good that that keeps happening. Uh, like I said, I don't know if I've mentioned it, this guy has a 40% evasion rate, which absolutely kicks my ass from time to time. Do we have any more eye drops? I only got two left. All right, we need to put that on him, definitely. And then we can float him when he is done with that. All right, go Gollum. Uh, I don't think that worked. I think I did it too early yet again. All right, continue doing Ice 3. Like I said, this guy has a ton of HP. So much HP uh, that I think I have to hit him. Wow. That That's going to screw me over. That's it. That's, that's the fight right there. There's pretty much nothing I can do at this point to win. Um, like I said... This requires a lot of level grinding and a lot of luck. I've been trying at this for far too long uh, to keep trying. Uh, so just for money uh, and just to show this guy off, it, it's, it, it doesn't seem worth it to me. And this is going to be one of the first times that I've ever had to outright abandon a, a fight. But that's the way that it's just going to have to go, unfortunately. Uh, because... You know, unless I get sword dance off with the time magic, that I'm pretty much screwed here. I, I, I don't have any way of doing damage. Yeah, that's not going to cut it. That's not going to cut it at all. Uh, this guy... Yeah, you can beat him. There is a way to beat him, but, you know, it requires level grinding. And like I said, it doesn't feel like the game intended you to beat him. It really doesn't. It feels like the game thought this was going to be a harsh enough punishment to keep people away uh, forsaking level grinding. And since I don't really want to level grind, I, you know, I, don't, I don't feel like doing an hour or two of level grinding to beat an optional boss where all I get is, is money at the end of it. Um, it. It's all about timing and all that kind of stuff. Alright, can I hit him? I doubt it. Yeah, not gonna happen. Okay, uh, let's get another phoenix down. I might be able to come back from this, you know, it's not impossible, but it, it is very unlikely, I think. Especially since, especially since everybody is now blinded. Um, you need to use the last eye drop that I got. It is still possible for me to win, don't get me wrong, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try, but my hopes are not high. Not in the slightest. Uh, another strategy that you're supposed to do is use Blink, but Blink wears off so fast. And I only have the one white mage, really. Um, you know, my party is kind of limited to what classes I've been using for him, and I have not been optimizing him for, particularly for this fight. Uh, so, it does make things kind of difficult that way. Uh, I, I'm pretty much back in action here, except for Float, but still, I am, I am fully expecting to die here. Uh, this guy is far, far too difficult. <laughs> but if I manage to pull it off, I will jump for joy. Most likely. But this guy, this guy. And down goes Reina. As pretty much expected. I didn't buy probably enough um, anything, to be honest with you. I didn't buy uh, eye drops. I didn't buy Phoenix Downs. I didn't buy anything. 
but now everybody is on the ground, which makes this fight even more difficult, as I'm sure we will see. Well, we might see. Maybe not. <laughs> um, let's see. We need to summon Golem again, and this is the last time I can summon Golem. I'm now out of MP. Like I said, I am just not a high enough level. Okay, let's get everybody off the ground here. So I say, can't I cast it on everybody? I can. Very nice. Everybody float, please. Uh, now you need to do ice three. And I can only hope and pray. Yeah, not, not enough here. Not enough. And now I need to start using ethers on top of this. This is how difficult the fight is at the level that I am. Is it possible? Yes, but it requires a lot of level grinding. We need, we need to keep Golem up at all times. That is our main damage dealer, or damage preventer, actually. The best offense is a good defense, right? As they say. All right, another Ice 3. Still not enough. Like I said, this guy has a ton of HP, and down goes Krill, which means I need to go for another Phoenix down. Ah, uh, so many items in this one battle, and I hate using items. And down goes Krill again. <laughs> Let's use another Phoenix down. And uh, she is on the ground as well, which is no good. All right, let's go for not enough for anything. So we need to go for another ether on Ferris. And uh, let's fight. We'll see. We'll see. Is that going to be enough? No. It is! Oh my god, I did it! No fucking way. Down goes Krill. I don't really give a shit. Yes! 5,000 gil! Three ability points! And I fucking did it. I did it. This is the first time I've ever beaten that guy. Especially at this low level. Holy crap. So. Hold on for one second. Okay, celebration over. Let's take the final few steps here. 4,000. Wait, I don't get anything for that last one. Oh, you absolute dicks. And you don't get anything for the way back. So, what I'm going to do is... Uh, can you use magic? No, because she's dead. Can you use... What What do I need here? Is it time magic? It is time magic! Let's teleport the fuck out of here. And... We have gotten all the money. I can't believe I did that, to be honest. I was very, very doubtful of myself. Let's get back on the dragon. I will, I'm will. i going to head back to more village so I can, you know, heal, buy items with my new money. That sounds good to you. Sounds good to me. I'll meet you there.